Hi, welcome to this Bybot Pro video. So this is a walkthrough of how Bybot Pro works and to talk you through the features. So if you proceed to an Amazon product page, you'll see that Bybot Pro loads automatically. When you first get Bybot Pro, it'll ask you for your email and your license key, and then it will come up like this every time after that. So you go into here and you enter your buy price. So as you can see, it's already populated the sell price for you. So you enter your buy price, click analyze or hit return on your keyboard. And within a couple of seconds, Buybot Pro will have analyzed the whole deal for you. So let me talk you through what you've got here. This is the customer panel and I'll come back to that shortly. So as I see, you've got your buy price, which will automatically uh, change the currency based on your, your country. You've got EFN fees. If you're in the US, you can just ignore that. If you're in the UK or in Europe and you want to ship EFN, then you can toggle that on and off and Bybot Pro will work out your fees for you for Europe. This is a bundle toggle and I'll cover that a little bit more when we go through the customer settings. So that's the analyze button. And as you can see here, then you can hover over the ASIN. It will give you the category, the weight, the dimensions, it will tell you whether Amazon sold the products in the last 90 days and whether Amazon is currently in the buy box. Now, BuyBot Pro is very, very clever and it can analyze a deal better than most OAs. So it also has some algorithms built into it, one of which is that it can predict the BSR percentage going forward. So as you can see, it predicts that this is going to stay as a 1% product. It is currently, as you can see, BSR bestseller rank of 1%. The BSR number is 286. You can see that I'm eligible to sell it and it can check that because I am logged into Seller Central on another tab. It's got a PL detector, which will talk you through whether there's any PL issues. So this one's green, no known PL issues. There's, it will come up yellow potentially and it will come up red if it's a brand that we know causes trouble. So it can, you can have a look through here when it, when it shows up those, it will give you a hover over and it will explain exactly what it's found in terms of private label detecting. It will tell you whether the product is hazmat and it will give you a SPQ, which is a suggested purchase quantity, which I will come back to shortly. So here it gives you your profit margin and does all your maths for you. And here is your break even price. So your break even price is the price that you could sell the product at, if you've purchased it at that price, the price you could sell it at with neither losing or making money. So here are your total costs and you can hover over that and it will break down all your costs for you and show you what they all are. It will work out your return on investment and it will work out your profit. And obviously I've been a bit crazy here putting in a pound or a dollar, you know, a product that's selling for, for 25 nearly. So it's, you know, it's a crazy ROI, but that's just because I'm just testing and show you what, what the, how the product works. So you've got your return on investment, as I say, and your profit. Your export function here is awesome. This means that you can export this deal to a Google Sheets document so that you can, you know, you don't have to copy and paste all the information from a deal into your buy sheet. It does it all for you. And I will show you how that works when we get to the customer panel when we go through that. So here is the BuyBot Pro score. This is what BuyBot Pro has analyzed the deal for you and is telling you whether it likes a deal and thinks it's a good deal and whether you should buy it or not. So this one, if you hover over it, it will tell you why it's giving it the score that it's giving it. It will give it the top three reasons. BuyBot Pro analyzes thousands of data points, thousands. So we couldn't list all the reasons it's given it, the score it's given it, but it gives you the top three reasons here. So it's saying that the FBA seller count is high at more than 30. Amazon have the buy box and the recent 30 day estimated sales have been awesome. So it's just giving you some things it's looking at in terms of analyzing the deal. So if you come down here, it will give you the estimated sales. You can hover over that to see it on a month by month basis, or it will give you the 90 day average. And another one of the very clever algorithms that built into BuyBot Pro, it will predict what the next 90 days is too. So if we come down a bit further, you'll see you've got a sales history chart here. So you can click on that and it'll open up in another window for you. And you can see all time or you can see seven days, 30 days, 90 days, 180. You can look at whatever you like to. You can toggle them on and off here if you don't want to look at certain information. You can toggle the lines on and off. And here for each of the ones that you're on, each of the times that you're on, it will give you the average BSR, the average FBA price, average new price and average Amazon price. 
So you can click through those and look at all the different averages of what's been going on with that product. So you can, you can click close or you can just click anywhere else to come out of the chart. And you come down to the competition analysis. Buybot Pro has looked at the top 10 sellers and it will list their position here. It will list whether they are a FBA prime seller. So if it's green, it's an FBA seller. If it's orange, it is Amazon. If it's blue, it's, an, it's a seller fulfilled prime. And if it is gray, it is just an MF seller. So you can look down at the price and you can look at the competition that you've got. And obviously it'll give you the stock levels of each one as well. So if you come down here, top 10 sellers, it gives you the total stock for the top 10 sellers, tells you how many are prime and how many are MF. Then if you come down here, it will give you the total number of sellers rather than just the top 10. It will tell you there are 34 in total prime sellers and 44 MF sellers. So if we come down here, you've got for those in Europe, you've got your European information here. So you can click on these and go off to the European page, but it gives you a quick look at the sales rank and the price for each European marketplace as well. So you can decide whether there is a, uh, you know, an opportunity there to sell in Europe at a bigger profit. So if you come down here to the VA toolbox, this gives you everything you need in terms of your VAs using Buybot Pro. And you can, I will talk you through how to do this. I'm signed in as a VA here at the moment. Um, so I can just click start if I want to, and it will monitor what I'm doing. It will take screenshots and send that to you as the client. Um, and I can submit deals if I want to that will go into the Google Sheets or go into the back end of Buybot Pro, which is a dashboard for you as the client. And you can go in and see what the VAs have been doing and you can keep a log of the deals that they found there as well. So I'll show you that shortly. And then here you can see that you've got deal criteria, which you can change from within the client area of the dashboard. And you can go in and change this so that if you want the VAs to search for something different each day, you can change it up so you get different deal criteria. And as you can see here, it says license for five devices because you can use Buybot Pro on five devices with each Amazon account. So for instance, you can download it onto your laptop, your PC and three VA machines, for instance. Okay, coming down here, you can ignore Profit Protector Pro. Profit Protector Pro is currently in beta. It will be the best repricer ever, but it's currently in beta, so I'm not going to talk you through that at the moment. Okay, so if we come up here and I go into the customer panel. So in here, you've got the option to add in a prep fee. So if you're working with a prep center, you can add in a prep fee. And you've got the opportunity to add in a bundle prep fee as well. Um, prep centers usually work on the basis is it's maybe 50p or 50 cents or whatever for the prep fee and then maybe another 20 cents or 20 pence for the, the bundle fee. So if you put 50 in there and 20 in there and if you toggle the, this on, Buybot Pro will add them together for you to make sure you're using the full prep cost and if you toggle it off, Buybot Pro will only use this prep fee here. So here's extra fees that you can add in anything extra you want to do, the percentage or um, a pound or dollar. This is the Google Sheets ID that I talked you through earlier. So this is <clears throat> where, we, excuse me, this is where we can copy a deal to our Google Sheets. So where I've analyzed this deal, if I want to export that deal, I can click copy to my buy sheet and it'll come up saying copy to my sheet. And if I come into my sheet, here is all the information on the deal in my sheet. So let's go back into here. Now, not everyone has their buy sheet the same, so you can click customize and you can change all the different columns of where that information goes. So you can tweak these and move these all to different, different places if that suits you better. So for instance, let's move this around. So let's move that to B, let's move that to A and let's save that. And if we copy it to my buy sheet again, we can come in here and we can see that it's copied these into the different columns. So if we continue down here, you can put your stock, how much you've got to, in terms of a budget, you can put that in here. And then Buybot Pro will work out this suggested purchase quantity. 
So this will be based on how good the deal is and your your budget and you know it's looking at all the different thousands of data points to decide what is the right amount to buy so if for instance you you know it will never suggest you spend more than 10 percent of your budget on any one deal anyway but you can put in your your budget there and it will help you work out how many you should buy the max buy count is for instance if you only ever like to buy 10 of one item you can put 10 in there or eight in there or five in there whatever it is that you like and then buy pro no matter how good the deal is will cut it off at this as your maximum so you can put your shipping cost in here so your shipping cost from your prep center or from your house into amazon and you can work you can add it per kilo or per pound and then buy pro will work out the weight of your product and your total shipping cost and include that information when it analyzes the deal this is the buy pro island which i'll talk you through shortly but you can toggle that on and off if you don't want it there okay so uk vat you should choose if you're um, in the US, obviously you would choose not applicable US sellers because you don't want to be taking VAT into consideration. If you're in the UK, then you should choose which, um, which what you are. So if you're not VAT registered, you choose not VAT registered, standard accounting or flat rate scheme. Now BuyBot Pro won't only work out the VAT on the Amazon fees. It works out all your input and output VAT as well. So it's extremely comprehensive and it's all been put together by a UK accountant. So if we come down here, this score that BuyBot Pro gives you is um, a Joe average score. It's, a, you know, it's just a good analysis of a deal. But if you particularly want something else, so you particularly only want 20 pounds profit or particularly only want something else, you can change your sliders in here and make it very specific to exactly what you want. And then BuyBot Pro will change the, the deal based on what you've told it you want. So if you were to put that up at 20 pounds and this, pro this, this um, product only has a profit of 17 then when we reanalyze the deal that would come up as red and say it doesn't meet your criteria because you've told it you want, don't want less than 20 pounds and you've also got in here you can choose fast sellers or you can choose mid-range or high profit and it will change the sliders for you but if you leave them alone then you'll get a very good Joe average analysis of the deal anyway Okay, so let me talk you through the island. So the island is here. This gives you a quick snapshot of the key information. So it gives you the profit, the ROI, the BSR, the estimated sales, whether you're eligible, whether it's hazmat and a PL detector. Of course, it gives you the BuyBot Pro score. And if you want to find out the ROI versus the sale price, this is a little calculator for you. So you could work it out backwards if you wanted to make sure you got whatever. You can change these and it will, it will change the ROI and tell you what the ROI is for, for each one. So you can change that and it will give you all that information and act like a little calculator for you working out that information. Now, before we go into the back end of the VA part, let me talk you through this part because here you can see you've got a product that has lots of variations and BuyBot Pro can also look at variations. So if you come down here, you'll see that when there's a variation, this will show up. <clears throat> excuse me so you click loading variations and you can see there's 274 different variations of this product and then buybot pro has loaded them all here for you so you can review you can click on there and sort it as you see fit you can it will look at the reviews and give you a percentage of which variant is getting what percent of reviews it'll give you an idea potentially of how well they're selling but not necessarily but you know it, it sort of gives you an idea of how many reviews they're getting and obviously the more they're selling the more reviews they're going to get and you can sort it however you want to you can just look at fba or just look at fbm you can switch these on and off and it will show you what you need to see and you can of course search for anything that you want to in here if you click on any of these it will take you through to the asin for that particular product so it'll take you through to that asin if you click on there so you can have a check out of each variation as you see fit. So let me take you through now into the back end of the dashboard where you can manage your VAs and I'll show you that part of BuyBot Pro. Okay, so if you go to buybotpro.com, you can see the VA toolbox login here. So if you click that, it will take you through to the login screen for the toolbox. Now, 
when you first set this up, you'll need to set up a different account, a different account for your Bybot Pro account, because on purpose we've made it with different login details so that your VAs don't have access to get into this area. So if you want to keep it confidential, that you can do. So you'd need to log to set up an account. It's only like about five questions, so you just need to get that done. And obviously this comes free with your Bybot Pro subscription. So you, you just set it up and then you get taken into this area here. So this is the dashboard. And as you can see, I've got three VAs set up here. So we've got Liz, Sally and Stuart, and it will tell me how many deals they're finding for, um, for me. So I, I can see that, you know, Liz has found, uh, Stuart's only found one, Liz has found 15, Sally's found three. It will show you how long each VA, how long each VA worked for. And you can come down here and see all the deals that they've submitted. And you can see screenshots as well of what they're doing. So that will be on your front page of your dashboard. If you come into the time logs, it will show you how each VAs, when they started work, when they finished work, how many deals they submitted and their screenshots if you want to see those. If you don't want to manage your VA in terms of timing, you can just, when they submit a deal, they can literally just, let me show you what they do. They come down, they'd click start, submit deal, and finish each time if you want them to, so that you don't they don't get any screenshots, but it's entirely up to you and how you manage your VAs. So if we come into the deals, here's the deals, you can see which VAs found the deal, you can have a look at your deal, you can click there to go through to Amazon, it will show you the buy price, the sell price and the buy bot pro score. Uh, it'll give the date and time that that was found. Click here to go to Amazon and then you can click here to go into your Google Sheets as well and view the deal in there if you'd like to. So if you wanted to look at screenshots, you can go in here and you can see the screenshots being taken of what the VA is working on and you can break it down there. I've not had Liz, these are only fake accounts that I've set up just to, to show you this. So Liz has not been working for more than a couple of minutes, so it's not taking any screenshots. But as you can see, if you're working for more than a few couple of minutes, then it takes the screenshots for you. And then you can obviously, you can look at all of them or you can look at yesterday's or the last seven days. You can you know, have a look at those. If you go into here, you can manage your virtual assistants. So you can add virtual assistants. You can make them active or not. And if they're not active, they won't be able to submit your deals. And obviously, you can you can look at this, the deals and those, those screenshots from here. Bybot Pro settings. Um, I'm not going to take you into there because it shows the license key, but it, it, that gives you the opportunity in there at the front of Bybot Pro where it gives you this deal criteria in here. It gives you the option in here. It gives you the option to change that in there. And then that's just the settings and the, the email address that I'm using for this demonstration. So that's the inside of the dashboard of the VA toolkit. And then last thing to show you is down the bottom, you can click on videos and it will take you to uh, a selection of videos teaching you, you know, lots of different ones showing you the, all, all the little different features of Bybot Pro in a little bit more detail so you can look at those. And if you've got any issues, you can click there and submit a ticket and we will help you solve whatever issue that you're, you're having. So that's how Bybot Pro works. I hope you enjoyed this demonstration. And Bybot Pro is awesome, can save you huge amounts of time and huge amounts of money. So scroll down now, click buy now, get Bybot Pro and, you know, make your online arbitrage deal business a lot quicker, a lot smoother and a lot faster.